Good morning, everyone. Another installment of Wellness Wednesday. I'm April Dupree with your fitness and nutrition expert, Mackie Shilstone. This is now week five of talking about exercises dealing with the hip and how important they are just for a multitude of reasons. So tell us what we're doing. We have a towel behind us. We have a yoga mat behind us. This is one that I'm really excited for you to explain to the people. We've done a variation of this before. This is in keeping with our improvement in hip, both in strengthening the hip capsule and in um, uh, flexibility. Okay. Right now, April, there is a sport out there called pickleball. It's kind of a variation between- Oh, we know. Between, it's very popular. Uh, 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 it's kind of tennis and and a little bit of ping pong, yeah. wiffle ball. And there is a significant amount of injuries going on in people 55 years of age. And I was reading a rather in-depth uh, review of this because there's really not that much research. But it appears, of course, what I've been saying all along, that everything's starting with the lack of mobility in the hips. Okay. With that pickleball, there's something called a kitchen. It's an area you can't go in, and people are f reaching in and don't have that balance, and, they're, uh, and they fall down. They're breaking this. They're straining oh, no. that. Surgeries. It's to me rather staggering that no one is addressing as we hope and to do. And so, it's such a popular sport. It's very it's popular. It's become very pandemic, popular yeah. for now. Uh, it's been around for a while, but very sure. much so. We're going to do something called a kneeling wall supported. And I'm going to like use, that. I'm going to use this bench. I could have a wall all the way up, which okay. might even be better. And I'm going to do thoracic rotation. The T-spine is 12 vertebrae from T1 to T12. Gotcha. And guess what causes the mobility? Hips. Oh, man. All right. Okay. Well, let's show us. So show us how I'm going to come on the I'm other side of I'm going to get you. down. I am going to put my this knee down. Now, notice I've got a mat and I have a towel because I want to protect my knee. Yep. I'm going to go into a, what I would call a modified lunge position. Okay. The only difference is I am now pushing my right hip into this. Into the wall. Okay, and my right knee can touch here. My hands are gonna be out and I'm gonna get in a little closer. There we go. I'm gonna put the hands out and I am gonna go back and I'm gonna open. But <laughs> notice what happened. High five. Notice this. Notice I didn't leave the wall. Oh, okay. So what might help some people is I come back and I pull the arm back by doing this, I might get around more. Now, what's right? There is no right or wrong. It would be good if you got all the way open. You okay. see what? And again, my arms could be up against the wall and come back. Now, again, I would come back and I can bend the arm and pull back right like that. All right, notice my arm is up and I've got that. I come back forward. Now, I can come over the top wow. and stretch back come back over the top and go this way. Notice what I'll do now. I will have the arms out, I'll lean in, hold this arm at home, I'll come back and look. So opposite for, direction. For, for me, I notice more of a restriction on my right hip, SI joint, sacroiliac joint, mm -hmm. than I do on the left side. Okay. So it, then I would of course turn around Put the knee down here. And do the same thing on the other and side. And do the same thing. Left hip in, rotation. Gotcha. Variation, internal. And I feel actually better. So it's telling me I really have to work on my right rotation. Yeah. So um, we have a couple of seconds left. Are we holding these for a certain period of time or just until it, it feels a little bit better would I think what I do with a one or two count thousand one thousand two thousand one thousand two you know uh, then I can come back and go and then I can come in all right I, perfect. I think a one or two count in between each and you saw me go both this way and this way again the key is that hip against the wall and that knee if you need to pushing all and right. that's going to give you the rotation perfect thank you guys so much for joining us find all of this information at maxwellnutrition.com and wwltv.com click on the health tab we'll see you next week